Hey there, YouTubers. It's Nikki. Um, we are back for week 11 um, pregnancy update post on my gastric bypass. Um, I have lost another pound. I am at 182. Um, this kind of made my um, brie a little bit. Um, if you are a wire um, that is been pregnant when you got pregnant, um, let me know how your your weight did. Um, that would be great. Uh, my obstetrician wants me to go see um, a new, I have a nutritionist from my surgery. Um, so I'm going to see if I can get in to see her. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah, I, uh, sorry, I'm going to sit cross-legged real quick to fix myself. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm 182, um, 11 weeks pregnant, um, clothes are not fitting, um, and that's okay. <laughs> Whew, excuse me. Um, so my family is going to come down the weekend around um, Valentine's Day. Well, at least my mom and my sister. Um, I think my dad kind of, because we're going to go shopping um, for maternity stuff and baby stuff. Um, I think my dad just kind of wants us to have a girls weekend, so I don't know that he'll be coming down. Um, so it's not this weekend, but next weekend, I think the weekend of the 11th. Um, so that's exciting. Um, we're going to go shopping for some maternity clothes. Um, so yes, even though I've been losing weight, um, my clothes are not fitting properly. I did go to a thrift and purchase um, for $2.75 a maternity um, knee length, right above the knee length blue jean skirt um, that I actually wore on Monday with some leggings underneath. Um, I thought it was really cute. Uh, let's see what else. Um, nausea is getting better. I still have bouts of nausea, but um, um, I think that they are from not from being hungry and telling me it's kind of, it's time to eat, as opposed to them being um, as opposed to them being morning sickness type nausea. Um, my belly seems a little upset in the evenings, but I think it's because that's when I take my um, prenatals and all of my extra vitamins. Sorry, if you guys haven't got it, baby makes you like, seriously, when I was larger, um, beginning of my journey, I would yawn a lot in my videos if you look back. And then um, I kind of got out of it once I started getting to a healthier weight. Um, at 182, I'm still at, um, I'm still considered overweight, so I'm not yet at a healthy BMI, um, but I guess we'll wait for that until after baby. Um, I'm going to stick with, my doctor wants me to stay under 200 pounds, um, so, you know, throughout the entire pregnancy, so we're going to work on that. Um, let's see what else. Um, oh, yes, my husband got a new job, um, first day started on Monday, um, and we're stoked about that because we found out today that, for, and we don't know why, we're waiting on the letter to come in the mail to tell us why, and then of course we're going to appeal the decision, um, but that his unemployment was denied, um, and that's that's three weeks of unemployment. Um, we were already, when he was employed before, a paycheck to paycheck family. So, um, you know, the month of January has been very tough for us monetarily. <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> but um, that's okay because we have some great family um, that has helped us out with that. 
um, especially because the doctor's visits um, for the OB are 500 bucks a pop, and that's with insurance. Um, so every month, um, I have a $500 payment to make to them. Um, I went on Monday for my second appointment. Um, things are going well. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, things are going well, and um, they did a courtesy, free of charge, ultrasound, um, which is wild because we didn't think we would get another ultrasound until about 19 or 20 weeks. Um, and so to get one at 11 weeks, we were pretty stoked about that, um, especially to see how baby wee tiny. Um, look at my video from a couple weeks ago and you'll see the picture. Um, it didn't really look like a baby. I'm so sorry. This yawning is awful. Um, but now it really looks like a baby. It's very cool. Um, I'm going to give you guys a body shot because you'll be able to see I don't, like I have my extra skin that I've, that I've had. Um, but I don't necessarily have, like, major baby bump until I, you know, it's end of day, I've been eating all day, and I sit down, and then it's like, boo, I look like I have major baby bump, which is crazy. I'm only 11 weeks. So, ooh, I got a message. Um, okay, so here's a quick body shot. You have to excuse me. I'm, I'm running out of clothes to wear, so... I have on some really old jogging pants that were big on me when I was over 300 pounds, so I have them on now. I gave them to my husband. See, they're, they're like, they're really big. Um, so I just kind of want to show you guys. So, this here is skin. This here, which, well, it's skin and it's a little bit of baby, I think, because it wasn't this much skin before. So I have, you know, I have this skin, but then, like, I can't, it used to be able to, like, tuck in, and now I can't, like, this is all the push, that's all the push that it has, so this is, like, this is all baby, and then I had, um, stretch marks here um, that had, you know, kind of gone away and they are re-stretching in the same stretch marks um, around my middle, uh, my belly button area. So it's weird looking, <laughs> um, but all is good, you know. I have the extra skin in my stomach area. In my pregnancy at the height of the North Carolina summer. So, um, you know, when people told me, oh, you're going to be one hot, miserable mama. Well, you know, I, I understand that it's different. And I'm, I might end up being just totally miserable in the heat of the summer. But um, I still will not, I'll still be 100 pounds less or more, less than my highest weight in the middle of a hot North Carolina summer, um, pregnant. So I feel very confident that I'll be able to handle it. Um, oh, and picture of baby. Let me bring it up on the computer um, because the actual ultrasound itself I have um, I have at home. Uh, this computer is being quite the handful. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to point a couple of things out to you. And I'm actually going to rotate this picture because I think it'll kind of be easier. It's easier to look at when baby's head is up and baby's rear end is down as opposed to like crooked sideways stuff. So,
Okay. I think this is how it's going to do it. Okay. So, this is baby. Gosh, I hope you can see that. I totally can't see. Yeah, you can see it. Okay, this is baby. Um, I right, let's get a little pointer here. This is baby's head. This is baby's feet, his little legs, and his bottom. Um, little baby is there up by his eyes. Um, then you can also see, I hope you can see this. We get to see 11 weeks. Um, so it's cool. So we can plan ahead of time. So we're excited about that. Um, I'm watching videos and stuff lately. Um, life has, has been, um, you know, just if nothing else in the strength that we're able to, to have throughout, you know, all the craziness that's been going on with baby. Um, okay, so I think that's it. We are 12 minutes in. This is the longest video I've made in a while. So you guys have an awesome rest of the week. And I will, oh, holy cow, I can't believe that I didn't, guys, <laughs> laugh with me here, you know adversary, um, tomorrow is a year to the day um, of me having gastric bypass, so, uh, me, um, 311, um, I lost some weight between the first time I went to the doctor um, and surgery day with my two-week pre-op diet. Um, so I was 288 pounds when I went in a year ago. I am 182. I have lost 106 pounds in the past 52 weeks that get to go before their surge anniversary. Um, I'm just not one of them and it's going to be a little longer now that I have baby on the way but um, but it's all good. I, I am blessed, I am happy, I am healthy and I wish the same for all of you guys. So until next week, bye.